morning, happy afternoon, happy Sunday. It is meal prep Sunday, and we are starting for our three-day meal prep class accountability group slash exercise slash all of the good stuff that makes up a well-balanced health and wellness uh, lifestyle. And I'm starting today with our muffins, our egg muffins. So if you are going to follow along and make egg muffins, what you need is the number of eggs you want. So what I am doing is two eggs for me on all of our nutrition plans that we follow, our two eggs is one serving. So if I wanna have one serving of eggs, um, that's my protein for that meal, then I'm gonna make myself two eggs. So for example, if I wanted to do six servings to have six different meals, so let's say I want three days worth of egg cups for two people, myself and my husband, I would use 12 eggs, right? So that is six servings. So for however many eggs you want to use and however many servings, just calculate that for your own family. All right, so um, what I have here is I have three servings right now, and I may add some more, but for the moment I have three servings. So I have six eggs in here. Um, I'm going to show you, it's just beat, beaten eggs. Eggs beaten, eggs beaten up here in the bowl, and those are ready to go. So now what the fun part is, is we get to choose what we wanna have with the egg cups. So one second, I'm going to get this, but I have learned my lesson. This is a floppy egg muffin silicone tin. Um, not really tin, but so what I need to do is put something other under it. Otherwise, getting this into the oven without spilling it is not gonna happen. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get my cookie sheet out, and I am going to put that underneath the muffin tin. If anything um, spills over, it's also nice to have that there. Okay, so how many servings am I doing? I am doing six, ser no, six eggs, three servings. Okay, so I'm gonna divide this up and I'm gonna go, there's one serving and I'm just gonna fill it half right now. And what I like to do is usually I like to put all the ingredients in the eggs, but since we're doing different ones for each person of the family, um, I'm gonna mix these eggs up. So I'm going to put them in the muffin tin first, and then I will um, put the ingredients in because I wanna mix it up, like I said. So there's two, four, six, that's three servings, but I'm actually gonna go a little bit more and do, fill that, all right, so there we go. Okay, so now we have still the same number of servings, we just have more muffins okay so now what i'm going to do you can see i have a lot of different things going on here i have all of my different toppings here i've got some kalamata olives i've got some feta i've got some zucchini i've got shallots mushrooms cheese cheese turkey ham and celery i'm not going to use the celery for now that was just there for my salad later for our crunchy salad later okay so what i'm going to do is the first two here i'm going to put in turkey and ham and those are going to be in the first two here the, the tricky part is to then see what you have and note and recognize which ones go to which person. So turkey and ham going in there. And oh, that's my indication that my greens are done behind me. Um, okay, so turkey ham in the egg cups, just like that. Okay, next up what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna leave those like that for a moment and I may just do turkey and ham in those. Um, I'm gonna add in a little bit of cheese because it's kind of like a Denver omelet if you do it that way. What else does a Denver omelet have? So those have cheese in them right there. So we've got turkey, ham, and cheese in the first two cups. Okay, next up, I'm gonna do one for myself. I love shallots, so I'm gonna put lots of shallots in there. So shallots are in that one. I'm gonna do, I think I'm gonna do a sort of a Greek style in this. So I'm gonna do shallots, I'm gonna do some kalamata olives, just like that. I'm gonna do a little bit of feta cheese. So here we go, just a little feta cheese in there. And then I'm gonna do a little bit of zucchini. So this Right here, these two right here are going to be mine. My egg cups will have zucchini, feta, kalamata olives, and that's it. So mine are kind of filled up there, but that's okay, I like them that way. Okay, next up, I may as well do some mushrooms. Maybe I'll do a little bit of mushroom and cheese. That one went in there, but that's okay. So mushrooms and, oops, I don't wanna get the mushrooms with the eggs. One moment, let me rinse that off. Okay, so mushrooms and I'm gonna do a little bit of cheese in the mushrooms too. So we're gonna do cheese, mushrooms, and that's it really. Maybe I'll do a little shallots in there too. But the fun part is is just to kind of mix it up and decide what you think you might like. Um, and just put in whatever ingredients you want. Okay, so now we have two left over here and I think I might just do those with cheese and eggs. But 
Now what you're gonna to wanna to do is you're just already, um, you had already sprayed the muffin, silicone tin, whatever you wanna call it, with, I spray it with olive oil cooking spray. So I've already sprayed that. I'm dumping in the eggs right away. Um, mama juice. Um, and the other thing is, is if you don't use a silicone muffin tin, it is impossible to get the eggs out. So I highly recommend using silicone because I have gone so far as to throw my muffin tin away because it was just, you could not get the eggs out of it. So highly recommend silicone here. I hope that it works for you. I'm gonna put these in the oven and you just have to do the toothpick test. So I'm gonna put it at 350. I'm gonna cook it for seven to 10 minutes. Toothpick test, do it again. It usually takes a little bit longer, like 20, 25, 30, 35, depending on how full your muffins are. So um, that's it. Make it fun, Makes it, make it enjoyable. Now what we're gonna do is later, we'll use two of these, or two and a half kind of, for our protein portion. So we're gonna use that for our protein portion of one of our meals. All right, so those are egg cups. That's Egg Cups 101, hope it helps. Go ahead and make them, let me know what you think. And um, if you do make them, post a picture. I would love to see what it looks like. Here we go, egg cups are going in.